Hello, I'm Kristen with the Rogers Public Library and this week for STEAM Explorations we are going to be making a caterpillar that crawls on a leaf. So in your craft packet you'll have a tiny dowel rod, a piece of a pipe cleaner, two little googly eyes, a leaf shape, and a rectangle. And I will show you how to put it all together. To begin, we're going to take our little rectangle of paper here and our dowel rod, and we're just going to gently wrap our paper around the dowel rod, and then you can go ahead and take it out and just roll it the rest of the way up, and we're going to glue it shut. So once it gets rolled most of the way, we can just put some glue along the edge and then roll it the rest of the way up, press down that seal, and then we still are going to have a hole that our dowel rod can fit through. And then we'll set those aside for just a moment. We are going to take our little worm and we're going to grab one end and just fold it back into a very small circle. And then we're gonna roll it back a couple of times and then turn it sideways and roll it back one more time. So it kind of stands up there and you have a little circle at one end and then we can shape the rest of it to be like an inchworm inching along so we want a little flat bit at each end and then a little hump in the middle now we're going to take our googly eyes and they should peel the backing off so that you can just stick them on but you can also use glue if you need to but you should be able to just peel that off and stick them right on there so we're going to put these eyes on our little round edge that we've made to make a little worm face a little caterpillar face whichever you want to call it and then we are going to glue the head of the worm or a little flat end up here to the end of our dowel rod and then we're going to glue the flat end at the back onto our green paper like this. Now you can use whatever kind of glue you would like to do this. I'm going to use hot glue just so that it doesn't have to dry very long and I can show you what it looks like and how we move it. But you can use any kind of glue that you want. Just you have to leave it long enough to dry. So I'm putting some hot glue on the edge of my dowel rod and then adding my little worm. And then I'm going to add some hot glue to the paper and stick the back of my little caterpillar to that. Now, whatever kind of glue you're using, you just have to let this dry. Once it's dry, we're going to add some glue to the bottom of the green tube here and we're going to glue that onto our leaf. So we'll just glue the tube straight onto the leaf. Not any part of the dowel rod, just our green tube. And again, you'll need to let this dry. Once all your glue has dried, 
you can see our worm looks like he's bent right now and as we pull the dowel rod back he squishes up even more and as we push it forward he stretches back out you can stretch him out all the way or just a little bit you can make him make little small movements or you can make him go big And that, our little inchworm or caterpillar on the leaf that can move around with the little googly eyes is our steam craft for today. Thank you so much for joining me and I will see you next week for another steam explorations. Bye!